Well, tonight we're getting a better look at the man charged with murdering a local tow truck driver after he called him for help. Kicking on Inland Empire reporter Nicole Comstock is live right now in Riverside with reaction from the victim's heartbroken family tonight. Nicole. Yeah, Jeff, the victim's sister tells me she was always worried about her brother having to deal with disgruntled customers out in the field. But she never thought that he would die here in Riverside over such a senseless argument. Now the family's trying to figure out how to tell his three young children why their father was killed. I keep thinking about him, and the picture that comes to my mind is my brother smiling. Unfortunately, the man charged with murdering Jesse Martinez is smiling too in his arrest photo. Riverside police say 32 year old Javier Martinez called for a tow truck Monday afternoon, got into an argument with a tow truck driver, Jesse, and shot him multiple times in this Riverside neighborhood. This person called for help, and my brother was there to help him. Jesse's big sister, Laura, says it never should have escalated this far because her 27 year old brother was. Just doing his job, supporting his three young children. Dispatchers on the phone with Jesse at the time said Javier climbed up onto the back of the tow truck to get his belongings, which was against company policy. Um, he asked him to get down. Obviously, he didn't listen. He was heavily intoxicated. Sometime after that, investigators say things turned physical. But Laura's family says her family is grateful for what happened after her brother was shot. As Javier was running away, a nurse who lived down the street ran to Jesse's side to start CPR. He was able to, in his last moments, possibly experience kindness from even a stranger. Police found Javier within 15 minutes, half a mile away in another neighborhood where they say he tossed evidence. They recovered some bullet casings, but a day later, they're still searching for the gun. Tonight, candles flicker outside the front door at Liberty Towing, where Jesse will be remembered as charismatic, self-motivated, and above all, a family man. His kids just kept pushing him to become better. And Laura says her brother wanted to work harder every day to take care of his kids, and that's exactly what he died here doing. Now, unfortunately, the family is struggling to come up with the money for his funeral expenses, so we've shared a link on our website to their GoFundMe account on kcal9.com. Reporting live in Riverside, Nicole Comstock, KCAL 9 News.